Question. Can you please explain how to practice the teaching of contemplate death with every inhale and exhale as one who is not heedless? Answer. That is referred to as contemplating, but in actuality, it isn't. It is focusing on knowing death. They've used the wrong word. How can you contemplate death? It is a long story. Contemplating death means contemplating from birth first. Start contemplating from birth and keep going until you hit aging, sickness and death. They are on the same course as I already explained in my sermon on how Rupananda contemplated death. When contemplating death, you must start with birth. You cannot just cut to death alone. What will be used to qualify or gauge it, that won't do. You must go from birth, aging, sickness, to death. It has to be the same course in order for it to make sense. You can't just suddenly contemplate death in the present. That won't work. That is called focusing on knowing death, not contemplating death. It is knowing that I am going to die. I am going to die. I am going to die. It is knowing it. That is a matter of samatha, or tranquility meditation. You have just misinterpreted it. It is focusing on knowing death by knowing, I am going to die, I am going to die. Constantly thinking of death by thinking that, I am going to die, I am going to die, is a matter of tranquility. It is not contemplating. Contemplating involves wisdom.